My budget silenced my mom and her husband about bootstrapping. A few weeks ago my family invited me to my brother's 21st birthday at the local casino and I told them I couldn't afford it. I could pay for gas to be there but I don't have money in my budget for pocket money for drinks, gambling etc. I told my mom that I could be present but I didn't have money to spend. He husband was saying I needed to make a budget so I did. I make 52k in a whole city, live alone and here is my budget. Rent 1200. Credit card 700. Best Buy 100. Car insurance 57. Tuition 140 on the 5th of the month until 12 5. Electricity. 100 during summer. 50 during fall spring. 1 2 double o, 6 double o, 1 double o 57 140 100 2197. Medications 35. Apple Music 20. Apple Care 11. Chat GPT 22. Disney 15. Prime 16. iCloud 2. Hulu 9. 35 2011 22 15 16 29 130. 2197 130 2327. Weekly deposit $725. Monthly $2,900. 2900-2327. month left not including gas or groceries. Gas is $50 week X4 200. 573 200 373. $373 a month to eat and for any emergencies. I did my budget and sent it to my family group chat and not one person said anything. I'd quote bootstraps I have left to pull up. I have an AA and BS degree and am working on a Python applications certificate at my local CC. I have 10 years of work experience in my field and a solid portfolio. I have been applying for jobs and getting interviews but get ghosted in the end. I really am at my wit's end with the US. I wish my grandparents never came here from Central America. My grandfather lived the American dream while I get the American nightmare. I know I'm not the only person feeling like this which is the sad part. End rant. Edit I didn't post this for sympathy which is kind of a weird thing to say. Why would I come on the internet and be entirely vulnerable and transparent for y'all to come shit on me? I know someone out there is feeling the squeeze financially too and if I feel alone, shitty, and bordering on suicidal because of my financial situation I know someone else is feeling it too. So this post is for them. You're not alone. Yeah. I think it's hilarious that they want you to pull yourself up by your bootstraps, when that means going to a casino. Okay, hull up. $1,200 rent? $50,100 electric? Call area? Sign me up. As a full-time student, you should qualify for prime student, which is only $6 a month for everything you get now, plus some student-specific offers. That'll save $10 a month right there. Is it possible to trim that budget? Yes. Should you have to? That's a good question. If it were me, I'd cut out some of the subscriptions so I could pay down the credit card faster. I'm sorry but what does $22 a month for ChatCup do for you versus unpaid versions? What do you mean by $700 credit card and $100 Best Buy? And why are you paying for chat GPT? Skull? They want you to spend money at a casino? Hard no. I wouldn't go even if I could afford to. Even if you did have extra scratch, why would you want to throw money away on overpriced food and into that oil at on slot machines and craps tables? You might as well burn money. What does 700 for credit card mean? I am copacetic with the situation but why are you giving Apple so much money? 
Seems like you may find a better way to listen to the music you like. I've found alternative ways at least and imagine that could be something you look at. Just wondering. If it doesn't include gas or groceries what is included in the credit card budget? Not trying to deny that your budget won't allow it but if money is tight then all the Apple Prime Hulu stuff isn't really a necessity. 573 200 373 People need to go back to downloading music. Get rid of Apple Music, get rid of all streaming such as Disney Hulu. Get rid of Prime and Best Buy. You definitely have some fat to trim. Oh my. I can't imagine spending that much on streaming services every month. I typically try to use free services whenever possible. You got six subscriptions. I don't know a single person with that many subs right now. You have too many subscriptions. Why are you paying chat GPT? You spend $700 on your credit card and $100 at best by monthly? I don't understand this budget. Also, if you think you don't have enough money, maybe consider cancelling your chat GPT subscription lol. That's so unnecessary. LOL 100 on subscriptions. You have 24 of take home going to a CC, 4 to best by assumed zero interest, and another 3 going to subscriptions. Yes casinos are a massive waste of time and money, but you've got some serious issues to address. Chat Ptlamau. Yo, $700 credit card and $100 best buy? WTF. Also, $95 on subscriptions for entertainment? Look at all them subscriptions.